give me a second, everybody. As of right now, you can see um, as you can see the platform that I'm on is actually Cryptex. Cryptex is actually um, a pretty good, decent so far, a pretty good, decent um, miner. Um, I could actually show some different settings. You can see PV mine. light mode which it, it's it's gonna mine but it's gonna your probability is gonna be very low mind you I'm also streaming um, as well so the prop my profitability will be will be different because um, I'm not using my full card the profitability will grow up higher I did another video which I uploaded to um YouTube so you could see it on Aeon flux on YouTube and um, it showed the probability, you know, and I, I didn't um, live stream live stream it. I showed it on my phone when I recorded it. So the probability was actually higher. But, you know, on this platform, I did not do a video to show um, what it actually could do. As you can see, I'm due for withdrawal. And this is just passive. This is just not even nothing full time. This is just something passive that I'm doing, passively doing off and on is not anything full time so I know the comments that people gonna say, oh don't do it and I, and that's fine you know what if your system is built properly you can make some money and it's not a whole lot of money I mean as you can see it really isn't it's just passively making some money when your computer is not when you're not gaming and you're not streaming and you're not doing videos and you're not doing a lot of things this is something that you know at least on this platform that I saw that I could do um, you know, I went into my settings and I put it on. Um, let me see here. Let me go into my settings here. Let me use CPU, right? And let me go back to that. So CPU is actually checked. Mind you, I am live streaming, so the probability is not going to be as high. Um, but you can see j just basically get a just or an idea of just basically what you can do on this platform. Um, you know, of course, it's going to be higher because you're not streaming and not live streaming because it's also streaming and also using, you know, um, the processing power to actually put up a video. So, yes, it's going to be different. It's going to fluctuate. I am running 64 gigs of DDR5. I am running a ROG um, motherboard 670 using an i9 uh, 13900K. I am using a RTX GeForce uh, 4090. Uh, Supreme X Liquid with a 240 um, AIO. Um, my s processor that I'm using has a Arctic um, 420 uh, liquid cooler on top of it. And my tower is a half 700 Evo by Cooler Master. And I have 3, 6, 9, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16 fans in total. Not in, I'm not including the AIO because that didn't come with it but yeah I have about 16 fans in here running um, well with no further ado I will show you basically um, what the mining potential could be oh, what you could be seeing minus less or actually more depending on how fast or what you have built with your mining rig you know it'll depend basically on what your specs are within your tower um, I basically um, did this you know just it was just a humbug it was nothing like you know something that's it's not full time it's not anything that I'm gonna be running constantly for that you do need a mining rig for it but I just want people to know I primarily game on this system but over time I was looking at it going hmm with the Bitcoin having that just happened I don't know if it's something viable I have no idea if it's something viable if it's something that you know people would want to see or, or, or do um, I just know that you know it's something that I looked at 
and was like, you know what, hey, a couple of dollars here and there, and I'm not using it, it can mine at night, and then I'll get up, and then I'll, you know, I don't let it run all day, I'll shut it off, come back, I'll get on the game, play the game, I might throw up a video, I might stream Call of Duty, I might stream something else, I might stream different games, and then, you know, at night, I'll let it run for a couple of hours and then boom so over time and this has been over like a two month period so yes theoretically yes you can make some money if you let it run and you don't want to blow cook up your system or you don't want to blow up your system it depends on how well you built your rig how well you built your mining rig how well you built your gaming rig what you're going to make and if you're willing to put it through that you know and most people are not willing to put it through that most people hate the bitcoin mining most people will tell you no most people will tell you i wouldn't do it you know, it's no profitability in it. And as, you know, maybe, maybe for what you're trying to do, maybe, you know. But as you can see, I made a little bit of money. It ain't a whole lot. But you know what? In time, if you if your system can handle it and can build and you're running, um, how could I say, um, you're running um, solar on your roof and you have everything running properly and you're getting a government kickback, why not? I mean, I don't see the issue, but everybody's different, you know, so I get, you know, the misconceptions, I get, you know, I just game, and that's why prices are so high, I get that, but I'm not a full-time cryptocurrency miner, I just do this passively, I'm going to say that again, that being said, I'm going to go ahead and start, I'm going to go ahead and start the miner. I'm curious to know what it can do while it's streaming. I, I'm actually curious to see what it can do. So while streaming, oh, there it is. It's still it's still trying to do some stuff. Oh, see, yep. So I know that if I wasn't streaming, I wasn't streaming. I could see about ninety-five, maybe a hundred dollars if I wasn't streaming or live streaming this. I can honestly see that. But I just. It was just interesting to me to see that my my gaming rig, the way I, without even knowing it, was capable of doing this. And I don't know. I'm pretty sure there's somebody out there that has a ten or twenty thousand dollar rig. My system is nowhere near that. <laughs> nowhere near that amount of money. But I don't see why not. I'm pretty sure that I I if your system can handle it, I wouldn't see where it'd be a big problem. Um, I think that. You know, it might be something that someone in a college dorm that's got free electricity might be able to do, depending on how build, how big, how robust they built their gaming rig. And um, it might be something that, you know, other people might find viable. Um, with that in mind, um, it might be something that somebody could, you know, might want to do, might not want to do, might want to do part part time for a couple of hours a day, maybe while they're at, you know, sleeping. And they get up and they turn it off and then they go to work, come home, game. And then when they go to bed, boom, let it mine for a, couple, for a minute. With this system, this whole CryptPad setup is very simple. Just put an email address, put your email that you want to link your account to, um, password. Write your password down. You don't want to lose that. It's going gonna, it's gonna to run a diagnostic that might take 10 to 15 minutes depending on what, you know, what you're running. And it will tell you if you can mine, if you could use this to mine or not. And what I like about it is it's, it's so simple. You know, you can go ahead and transfer your funds to your credit card. You can go ahead and transfer to a digital wallet. Very simple. They make it very simple. You can go on YouTube and look up Cryptex. There's so many videos about it, about the platform. It's a very good platform. I would advise people to, you know, if, if you're interested to look into it. Um, other than that, um, you know, I just let it rock for a minute and just let see some people see. You know, it's not a whole lot of money, and, you know, I, I get it. But at the end of the day, um, it's just something that I, I, I thought was kind of cool to be able to do it. I mean, in, in its own way, kind of cool to do it, if your system can handle it. Most 
some people's system can't handle it, but, you know, mine can handle it, I, I, I haven't pushed on it and beat on it, you know I'm running at, um, well, I could tell you right now, my temps, let's see what my temps, temp is, let me bring this up here, so right now, you can see my temp, at least for my GPU, 61C, that ain't bad, my CPU, hey man, my CPU is working, my CPU is working hard, and it's at 70, I could look at my motherboard, it's at 71, I don't think, I don't think that's smart to do that, and push it this hard, but that's only because I'm live streaming, and doing that, I normally see temps, I normally see temps at 60, maybe 59, see, and I'm running um, a 420 AIO, but if I went to a total liquid build, a liquid build, it probably would be a lot cooler, which is optimal. But this is not something that I'm going to be doing continuously and something that I'm going to be doing full time. And you know, so I just thought it would be something cool to just, just look at and give somebody an, uh, an idea. And I'm pretty sure my profitability is going to go way up. Um, once I once I uh, end the end the stream, it probably go up to like ninety five, maybe a hundred bucks. But you know that's okay. You know I I, I see that. Um, you know from my research that I've done, um, from forty to forty five, you, you, you most most cars are idling. 55 to like 60 you don't want your card going to 70 C you do not want your card going to 70 C at all you don't want that you don't want your card going to 70 C you don't want your card going any higher than that you might want to just um how could I say you might just want to um, pull back you know and I and, and 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 look if you look at the way I have my clocks here I, I'm running basically I just turned my fan up I haven't uh, I haven't overclocked anything this is based this profitability is based off of what the Bitcoin market is and it's based off of that so no it's not a lot of money it's not it really isn't it is once mass adoption happens and that's when it will be but other than that I don't really see I don't it, it, you, you unless you got multiple cards and you just that guy that had the money and you didn't get rid of any of your cards and you're doing that I, I don't really see um, you won't see, you know, according to Cryptex, when you look at it on, on, on Google and you Google it, a person with 39 cards could see 15, 15, uh, thousand or six, some, some astronomical amount. And I was like, wow, well, I, it would have to be something where your electricity, the cost, but you know, the 10, you know, how, how much money you're paying per kilowatt would be something that, you know, most people would look at other than that. You know, no, that wouldn't be viable for me. I'm not going to have 50 cards. I'm not going to have none of that. You know, so I, I, I tip my hat to the people that got into it early. They are able to make a profit out of it. I tip my hat to them. This is something that I, you know, a couple of hundred bucks here and there. Hell, why not? That's what it is for me. 